Good morning. This is uh, Good Friday. Uh, my uh, this coffee Ben's mugs um, is my mug today. Uh, I've got this at Goodwill or Savers, I think. I'm not sure when, but years ago I loved it because I do not drink my coffee with anything in it. It's completely black, and uh, this is Good Friday. Um, this is um, Hebrews four sixteen. Let us come boldly to the throne of our gracious God and and receive his mercies. Um, this is um, the day that Christ was crucified. Um, it's crazy. If you watch the movies, Jesus of Nazareth and and uh, the Passion, and there's been uh, several versions of it. Um, they've all kind of depicted, you know, that I think the bit, the most controversial thing of it, of it all is how much blood he shed. Um, there are many people that claim that there just wasn't enough blood in any of the movies, even The Passion, a uh, very bloody movie. I can't let my kids watch it yet because it's just too gory yet again, um, not enough blood. Um, but this is interesting because um, um, the whole point of it, it's not how much blood was shed. The whole point of it was that he died on the cross. And uh, I think in the scripture here um, in Hebrews, uh, where it indicates uh, the boldness. God wants us to come boldly to the throne um, to him. And uh, because we don't, we just don't. Do I a lot of times come boldly to this throne? I don't. And I think that's why they're really claiming that we need to uh, do that is because we just don't do that. We uh, we come when we when we need him. He's almost like a practical thing. You know, what? Uh, I'm only going to ask, I'm only going to come when I, I'm really desperate, you know. It's like, why aren't we doing this all the time? He wants the real deal from us. He does not want, because he, gosh, he, he knows us. And so that's our scripture of the day. Um, um, I guess uh, it ties right in with this thing. This coffee, Ben's mug, come boldly. This is bold coffee. So um, happy Good Friday, and we'll talk to you later, guys.